Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. IRS free file marks record increase available through October 15th. IR 2020-230, October 6, 2020, Washington. The Internal Revenue Service announced today that FreeFile, the IRS private sector partnership that offers free tax preparation products, scored a record percentage increase in new users as taxpayers turned to free name brand providers in 2020. So if you're below a certain threshold, then the free file option might be a good option to look into. You can look into how to provide your tax return uh, in a free file format. There's typically going to be like an income limitation. And just from a practical standpoint, you typically, once you get over a certain point of income, might want to look into some other uh, system. But it's definitely worth worth checking out if you can get the free file uh, system in place. Now, note, as you do a free file, if you're thinking about looking into some kind of free file uh, option, you can check on the IRS website first. That's the first place I would start to look at. But just realize that when you're looking at the IRS website, you're looking at the federal side of things. If you have a state obligation, just make sure that whatever system of tax preparation you are using also picks up the state that you need, your state uh, requirements as well, or that you have some way to fulfill the state obligations. Because when you're looking at the IRS website, you're looking at the federal obligations. The state obligations can be a little bit more tricky, although tax software is getting better and better at uh, being uh, to manage the state obligations because the states obviously we have a separate uh, you know different obligations for each state the laws are going to be different for each state whereas the the internal revenue service or the federal side of things will be the same for the entire country so and then also if you get over a certain threshold of uh, of income typically your tax return will be complicated enough to the point where you might want some more sophisticated proprietary software that you would actually pay for and if your your tax return gets more more complicated past that point then you probably want some advice on your tax preparation possibly not just someone to prepare the taxes but someone that you can kind of build a relationship on hopefully as your income continues to grow so that they can help you give you tax advice as well as uh, tax preparation services. So back to the text, IRS free file online products marked a 50% increase this year as more than 4.1 million taxpayers used one of the free file partner products. Last year, more than 2.7 million taxpayers used free file. Uh, free file remains available through October 15th for those taxpayers who still need to file their 2019 return. So notice that it's not available like forever. If you needed to go back and file, you know, tax returns for 2018 or 2017, probably not available to you. So you have to do it like before the deadline in order to get access to the free file option. However, if you extended your tax return for 2019, the deadline is October 15th. So therefore, if you haven't filed the 2019 tax return, you may still have the option of the free file software if you file before the deadline for the extension, October 15th. Quote, the IRS has worked with our partners to make important improvements to the free file program of this year, and we are encouraged by the strong increase in usage, end quote, said IRS Commissioner Chuck Reddick. Quote, the IRS remains committed to supporting and promoting this free service that benefits so many taxpayers, end quote. Additionally, 96% of the people who had no filing requirement and who registered for an economic impact payment used an online tool supported by free file and the consortium representing the tax software providers who partner with the irs free file incorporated uh, develop, developed the non-filers interpayment info here there's a link to that tool here uh, that gave americans with no filing requirement a free way to get their economic impact payment more than 7 million non-filers have registered for payments so far with more than 6.7 million non-filers using the free file incorporated product the non-filers tool available on the iris.gov homepage remains available through november 21st following the announcement that the deadline for non-filers to register had been extended so note the non-filer deadline has been extended again, but this is like the last time, so this is for serious now, to November 21st. So for those that, that have not filed, have not received the economic impact payment because their income's below the threshold, uh, you may still be able to use the non-filer tool up until November 21st, and then that's it, unless they change, unless they extend it. But they're not gonna, unless they do. Okay, so how free, so how free file works. Taxpayers whose adjusted gross income was 69000 or less in 2019 
can choose from multiple online preparation products in English and Spanish. Taxpayers whose income was higher can opt for free file fillable forms, the electronic version of IRS paper forms. So in other words, let's go through that again. Taxpayers whose adjusted gross income was 69,000 or less in 2019 can choose from multiple online preparation products. So that's going to be kind of like the income threshold that you're going to be thinking of. Uh, they're going to be in English and Spanish. Taxpayers whose income is higher can opt for free file fillable forms. Now, the free file fillable forms are kind of like the, the paper filing, but using an online tool, which is a lot more difficult than using software. So if you're not experienced with tax preparation, then even if your return is fairly basic, it's a little bit, that's a lot more complicated to basically go through every box on the, uh, on the fillable forms than to use the software that's going to be typically in more of an interview type of process. So if you're over that threshold yeah, and you're, you know what you're doing or you want to really kind of go over the forms, then you can use the fillable forms. But I would recommend uh, at that point using possibly proprietary software or talking to a tax professional. You might need advice uh, if you're somewhat over that, th over that income level at some point in any case. So here's how, that's just my opinion, of course. Here's how taxpayers can use free file. Go to the irs.gov forward slash free file. There's a link to that here. Select choose an IRS free file offer. Choose between browse all and start lookup tool to find the right product for you. Follow links to the free file providers tax product. In 2003, the IRS and the free file alliance, now free file incorporated, a consortium of tax software providers began offering free tax software and free electronic filing, uh, filing to tax taxpayers. There, there currently are 10 partners offering free products, including two products in Spanish. IRS, uh, IRS Free File is the main provider of free electronic tax preparation services for low to moderate income Americans and, in aggregate, one of the top e-file providers within the tax industry.